Fourth ventricle. Ventricles of brain. We look into the four cavities constituting the brain's ventricular system. The first and second ventricles, commonly known as the lateral ventricles, are positioned in each cerebral hemisphere. The third ventricle is a medially situated cavity sandwiched between the cerebral hemispheres. Lastly, we have the fourth ventricle located at the level of the brainstem. This image brings us to the tent-like cavity of the hindbrain, the fourth ventricle. It is positioned in front of the pons and medulla and behind the cerebellum. Moving to next image, here we explore the boundaries of the fourth ventricle. The infralateral boundaries are made up of the inferior cerebellar peduncle, gracile, and cunit tubercle, while the supralateral boundary is formed by the superior cerebellar peduncle. The floor, or the rhomboid fossa, is diamond-shaped with an upper triangular part formed by the posterior surface of the pons and a lower triangular part formed by the upper part of the posterior surface of the medulla. The intermediate part is marked by the presence of transversely arranged fibers, the stria medullaris running from the arcuate nucleus to the opposite cerebellum. Noteworthy features include the floor divided in half by the median sulcus. On each side of the sulcus, there's an elevation known as the medial eminence. The medial eminence is laterally limited by the sulcus limitans, which presents two depressions, the superior fovea above and the inferior fovea below. The locus ceruleus, a bluish-gray area above the superior fovea containing melanin pigments, constitutes the substantia ferruginea, an oval swelling on the upper part of the medial eminence, the facial colliculus, is formed by the motor nerve fibers of the facial nerve winding around the abducent nerve nucleus. The hypoglossal triangle houses the nucleus of the hypoglossal nerve. The vestibular area, located lateral to the sulcus limitans, contains the vestibular nuclei. The vagal triangle overlies the nuclei for the vagus, glossopharyngeal, and cranial accessory nerves. The funiculus separans, a faint ridge, divides the vagal triangle, and below this ridge lies the area post rema, also known as the vomiting center. Finally, the calamus scriptorius resembles a pen nib in the lower part of the fourth ventricle's floor. The obex, a small fold, is formed by the meeting of tinea at the inferior angle of the ventricle.